Hi, this is Matt Levy from CornerOfficeCoach.com. We're doing a series of videos on the keys to successful career management. It's what I call the three A's, attitude, activity, and assertiveness. Today I'd like to focus on assertiveness. Assertiveness is really, really important in the job search process. By that I mean the folks that you want to meet with, hiring managers, recruiters, power connectors, and influencers, they're really, really busy people. These are the folks that you want to meet with, but they probably have a demanding day job. They probably have a second job where they do consulting or teaching. They're probably on boards of directors. They're probably out there busy networking already. These are the people that you want to meet. You can't just send them an email, and if you don't hear from them, stick your tail between your legs and cower away. Instead, you have to be bold. You have to follow up with them on multiple times. Maybe try a different communication method. If they're ignoring your email, try Twitter. If they're ignoring Twitter, try cell phone, text messaging, Facebook, etc. You need to understand how do they like to best be connected with, to connect, and then connect with them in that way. Assertiveness, I'm talking about showing the right amount of assertiveness. I like to use the analogy of tomato sauce. Why tomato sauce, you ask? Well, you need to season your tomato sauce with salt. Too little and it's bland and distasteful. Too much, it's too salty and also distasteful. It's the, it's the same thing with assertiveness. You want to find that right blend where you're showing enough assertiveness that you're getting people's attention, but not too much and being a pest about it. You can use this assertiveness to try to get the attention of, of hiring managers or recruiters. You want to network into target companies. You want to apply for a job and then find power connected people in that industry and at that company. You want to even try to find the hiring manager. You want to network in and show assertiveness to find them through maybe LinkedIn, for example. It's also important just to get networking appointments with the most connected people in your industry in the region. Sometimes they won't listen to a simple LinkedIn message or a simple email. You need to network in and around them. Find their sphere of influence, contact other people, and they can introduce you to them. You want to use your assertiveness to get informational interviews when you're applying for jobs, when you're trying to get into professional organizations, when you're trying to get into, into boards of directors. You need to show this type of assertiveness to get their attention. By doing all of this, by following the three A's of attitude, activity, and assertiveness, you'll surely be discovered along the way in your career. You'll be discovered through LinkedIn, Twitter, article writing, presentations, through your board membership, and through being on committees. It'll result in first page Google ranking, consulting offers, speaking engagements. You'll get job offers. You'll be offered to do interviews and write articles, and you'll get additional certifications. In the end result, you'll do a the end result is you'll do a great job of managing your career, sometimes actively, sometimes passively. But I do, I do, uh, I'm sure of the fact that if you follow the three A's of attitude, activity, and assertiveness, you'll have a robust, rewarding career where you'll hold jobs of increasing importance. You'll be helping people along the way. This is the three A's, and this is the keys to successful career management. This is Matt Levy from CornerOfficeCoach.com, helping you accelerate your career with the inside angle. I hope you make it a great day.